Hey guys, good morning. I'm so tired. I'm with Yana already. And we're gonna go downtown. Hey. I deleted a big clip that I recorded like in the morning by accident, so sorry. So we are going to buy some climbing chalk. Is that what it's called? Yep. Um and we're gonna go try Bonnie Boys for the first time, finally. Even though we live in Toronto and we never go. I don't get that. What else are we doing? Um, shopping. We're gonna try to shop. Walking around, eat lots of food. Um, <laughs> what's, what's new? Anyway, um, it's pretty cold today. It's like, it says it's like negative 10, but it feels like negative 70 or something like that. Something kind of ridiculous, <laughs> but we're used to here. Anyway, uh, I guess I'll show you the food when we see the food too, because we're in Scarborough right now. We're we're in Timbuktu compared to where it's supposed to be. This is still weird because I haven't done this for a, while. a month. Today's the twenty fifth. Oh yeah. It's been a month exact since I last vlogged. So I'm a month old, past nineteenth. Nine. What? I can't speak English. I should just quit now. I got, what is this? Tofu kimchi fries. We have the pork on me. I think she has pork too. Yeah. So this is gonna be cool. So what do you think? It is really good. It is really good. But this is, it costs how much? Like $6 each? $5.50 for the what's it? $5.50? Yeah, we're just $5.50. $5.50 for the ballpark bombing, which is what we got. And also we got the Um the tofu fries, which is I don't know, I haven't tried it yet. All natural and it doesn't have any additives or anything, so it's not that as bad for your skin. Whereas this, this one, one has additives, but the good thing is it's, it helps because I have sweaty hands, right? So oh, so this helps, one helps yeah. with, with like clammy hands. Yeah. Or people yeah. who perspirate more on their hands. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's, We're it's, also it's at not where, a, where are we? Mountain Equipment Co op. MEC. Yeah. This place is really cool. I should show you. This is. I still don't remember what this place is called, but this is what it looks like. This place is humongous, to be honest, I didn't really know. <laughs> so we finished shopping. She bought her stuff. Where is it right there? Yeah. Now we don't know what we're going to do because we have like three and a half hours left to do nothing. So we're just literally walking around Toronto doing nothing. Like, what are we going to do? That's Roy Thompson Hall. Oh, Robin Hood is on. Yeah. Do you guys see it? Do you see the tree? <laughs> really nice. I haven't watched anything at any at, at, at any of these theaters, <laughs> but I've been to Roy Thompson Hall. Mm. I'm cold. I'm gonna put my phone away. <laughs> Yes. So we are gonna go to Eaton Center now. Well, I don't think we're gonna go to Eaton Center. I think we're gonna go to Muji instead because we haven't been there yet. And the open one here, so why not? And I think they film suits here. I believe it was somewhere in this area. If I were to walk and show you this way, does this look like it? I can't really tell. But I spilled her coffee everywhere. Sorry, I'm even a tourist in my own city. Look, I don't even know what this place is. <sighs> do you have anything you need to buy? No. But I do want to check out Muji because they look like they have cool stationery and stuff. Yeah, I, I, I think it was Vanessa who posted a picture of it showing us a bunch of cool stationery stuff. Yeah. We have to buy a couple of stuff there couple of stuff whatever can't speak too cold fast forward like 
what, like an hour and a half, and we still haven't just decided where we're gonna go eat dinner. So we're sitting um, in the path, just trying to figure out what we wanna do. And I bought a scratch card and I lost. And she bought nail polish and got it on her hands. Mm -hmm. You got my fingers. Uh, ew. She's touching her vagina. Yeah. Our options right now are either like a ramen shop, which I've been to most of them in this area, which is Eaton Center, uh, or what other places do we have? Places near Salad King for Thai food. There's... It's all ramen places. Have you had Joey's before? Joey's, yeah. That's good. Oh my God. What else? I don't know. We this is This is what we've been doing for the past, like... 15 minutes. Like, we do not know what we want to do, so... Help. Give us suggestions. So we ended up at North York Center. Somehow. What are we doing? We are just traveling all over Toronto today. Like, this is fun. So we're gonna we're gonna go to Michael's because first I did arm knitting. Now I want to try crocheting. So that's what I'm gonna do. We're also gonna go to Suki, which is just down the street that way. So I'm gonna put this away because I'm cold. So we are at Suki. Um, it's really loud here. So. And uh, basically, it's a Japanese tapas bar. Is it a bar? It's a restaurant. Where you just order a bunch of little small stuff to share and eat, and it's good food and everything. I will be adjust the camera and show you. So, you have like the appetizers, and then you have some. Uh, I mean, you can make it here. Okay, sorry about that. You have the grilled stuff, the fried stuff, and then you have. Desserts and they also give you drinks at the back. And then there's the sashimi and sushi. Oh, there's some other dishes here too. Whoops. Are you gonna go? Next. I can't see you. <laughs> so we order the cheese bulak, the balsamic beef steak, beef balsamic steak. Um, Russian roulette roll, which is going to be really fun to show you because one of them has just wasabi in it. And then we also ordered a karage, which is like a deep fried chicken. It's like chicken nuggets. And this is her first time here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's having boy problems. Again. Long story short, a boy is talking to her too much for her likings and she doesn't know if it's more than something or just very nice. And the way it looks like it's probably more than something. Because I've been your friend for a long time, so I I've 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 been friend zoned already. Like I that doesn't matter to me. But the way I can see it is that if you stop talking for a really long time and you start up a conversation constantly like this, then either he's trying to get to know you, or he's trying to bring back the friendship you had before. Which I don't think he has. He wants it because he already has that. So I think he's trying to mac on you. Or Iris. You can't even see me. Sorry for the lighting. I can't really do anything. So here is the um, beef. Thank you. This is the beef balsamic steak. And we also just got our cheese buda. And this one is trying to sign up for Chipotle. Chipotle! Guys, Chipotle is alive if you can even see her. So we're about like 10 minutes into eating. How do you enjoy it so far? <laughs> Which one is your favorite one? So far, the steak. The steak? The steak is awesome. Me too. I love I love balsamic and I love steak, so it's like the best thing ever. The kadaga is really good too. This one is my least favorite, but I, this is still something I really like though, which is kind of funny. Anyway, we're gonna eat. So I brought a tripod with me so I can film while we do this. We got our Russian roulette roll. You'll see. And now we're gonna do this. So I'm gonna take one. 
me to add more wasabi to it. No. Are you gonna take one? We're gonna take one at the same time. Okay. Ready for this? Ready? I'm gonna clear. Because we're stopping here. Oh. We're all clear. Oh. We're on the next one. I think I might run it. Is it a lot of wasabi? I'm tearing up. It's not me. On the first one. Cheers. I didn't get it. Then that's probably you. I didn't get it. We're gonna eat more now, okay? So we finished. We finished eating at Suki, and that was pretty good, wasn't it? It's it's her first time. And guess what? Yan forgot her stuff, and the and the server ran out to give it to her. Like she's so nice. Which I appreciate. I know. She's so nice. So. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go and get um, bubble tea. Um, we're gonna try at a new cafe. We're gonna go to Cafe Bene, I believe, because I've been to quite a bit of them. Uh, um, <laughs> I've been to Cafe Princess. I've been to Orange Caramel. I've been to Most Cafe, which closed down unfortunately. I've been to Mabu Station. I've been to Tea Delicious. I've been to Tea Shop 168. I've been to Cha Time. I've been to ZenQ. <laughs> Everywhere. Yeah. Everywhere. Um, it's just something that I do all the time. It's like, whatever. It's an addiction. Yeah. And the thing about it is that a lot of my friends, they ask me to go with them because they want to try too. So then I end up going with them. So it's, <laughs> it just kind of ends up doing that. So we're just going to walk over there because it's not that far. I mean, it's about like a 10 minute walk. And she doesn't have a Metro Pass, so I have to do it. <laughs> Sorry for making work. It's okay. Work it's it okay. Off. I gotta work it off. Anyway, it's about. Oh, I'm blocking the screen. The camera. It's about 8:30, almost 8:40. Yeah. I'm just gonna go. It's not, it's not late actually, but it just looks so dark. Look at this. Okay. See you when we go bubble tea. Finally in a warm place again, and we are at Cafe Benny, which is this place. So they have like bubble tea things, they have ice and hot coffees, they have a lot of food actually, I didn't know. Um, they have waffles, binsus, which is like crushed ice or shaved ice, and smoothies and ice creams. And they have some, they have other things, like they have games here, they have like playstation stuff at the back, I didn't know about. Yeah, see, I didn't even know until I looked in the back. So we're gonna pick up some stuff, I think I'm gonna get like... Probably just take a bubble tea or a drink or something. Um, not too sure. We might, I don't know, we are, if we're considering getting a thing soon. I don't know. So, I guess we'll choose that. Like, no. Okay, so we just ordered. We just ordered two drinks and one waffle. Uh, I ordered. I ordered a... What did I order? Oh, I ordered a mango and kiwi slush with tapioca. And she ordered a green tea, green tea latte. Green tea latte. Hot? Yeah, hot. Because, you know, it's cool. And we also ordered an Oreo choco waffle to share. Because we didn't eat enough today, or she can tell. It's okay, we walked like, what, like eight kilometers? We almost walked eight kilometers today. I don't really know how much we walk now because I haven't checked it since we, since we walked together. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we're, this is our first time here, so let me, take, let me give you a little tour behind me. So this is Cafe Bene. It's really small. And this is the corner over here. I know, I'm facing the fairy. <laughs> it's right here. Can they see it? Uh, higher, but yeah. I can see the reflection. Yeah. There's a random fairy hanging over here. It's pretty fairy, but it's kind of random. <laughs> Why? So, I guess 
I'll just have to wait for the food. Cool. Flames almost true. Cool. More like the pizza. Oh, oh, no. yeah. So this is my bubble slash thing. This is our Oreo. Wow, it stinks. Um, this is our waffle. Mm -hmm. The ch Oreo chocolate. Mm -hmm. She has her almost done latte. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So there's oh, someone in Daryl or Daryl to find Daryl fix her. Yeah. But nice. Apparently, my name's Daryl now. Daryl. Hi, everybody. Well, it's it's the end of the day, and we're gonna go home because her dad's picking us up. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. So I will see you guys back here next time. And so, until next time, bye. <laughs>